Hi yo, Wettenbau Club. Let's kick it. <laughs> Just finished uh, this one here some days ago. Uh, it's for my Amazon's ad tags. I'll show you. They're only partly painted. I'm so I'm so bad at painting minis. Crafting is much more fun. Let I show you. And then the box is the Amazon shame. Those are really cool. Blow arrows, close combat. She will be a magician. She's got a crocodile armor, a snake with wings. Chieftain, yeah, and some more. So this will be my gang. Fast runners and hit and run, and I hope fun to play and a little bit of magic. So those ladies need a, oops, ah, fingers. <laughs> a table to play on. And we play on 90 by 90 centimeters. That's three by three foot. They get special abilities. They are really good in forests. So we need forest and I want temples. So this is the sketch. I want one centerpiece pyramid and four small pyramids um, and then woods and small scattered terrain between. So this will be my first really symmetrically uh, yeah, organized um, board. The thing is, all that material. I will have a lot of styrofoam cores. Uh, I had to rip out the old insulation of my roof because there was water damage and everything had to go out. I did not throw away the styrofoam. <laughs> I, it's piling up in my garage. <laughs> this is several cubic meters of styrofoam and those sacks is ripped up styrofoam. Yeah. That's a lot to lot lot to build with. <laughs> so I made those here some time ago, and just for height testing, uh, each block has one of those as a core. That's three centimeters, a good inch, and then some XPS painted around. This is a good height for the minis. Each block has two of those glued together and then covered in in this uh, yellowish um, XPS with carving. That's the plan. <laughs> it's a really cool plan. It's a lot to do. Um, a friend will help me. Uh, Mitch Scribbles on Instagram. He's Mitch Scribbles. He lives like 10 minutes away. Um, we, we play a lot together. He's a great mini painter. Um, and we will build this together. He's got holiday and now he, we are doing some crafting together. <laughs> the whole day. Yes, yes, yes. <sighs> crafting is my new addiction. Making toys. So great. So, let's go. <laughs> Große Figur der 5 auf 5 cm Basis, gell? Zieh mal raus, so ein Karten. Hello. Gehst du hin? Gehst du hin? 
Ja, er ist, es ist alles aus einem Guss, aber natürlich chaotisch, so wie ich immer. Ach so ist ja in der Natur da, oder nix, ist ja nix. Immer im Hinterkopf haben, dass du ja eigentlich auch ein Video machen willst. Didn't want to bore you with all the XPS cutting, different sizes, different thicknesses. So let's see what we got. Holy moly. So we finished all the stairs with some texturing and uh, some demolishing. That's a lot of XPS cutting today. I had the windows open and the door open and they had a draft because of all the fumes and stuff. So were uh, very well ventilated and I got some styrofoam here. Yeah, that's still a lot to do. Okay, let's start carving. Just googled some more images for Aztec stone carvings. Oh yeah. So for the center temple. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I would love to do that, but those sculpted heads. Let's do it like this. I'm using those, I'm making those now, those snaky bits here, those, yeah. Okay, that's, that's what I can live with. Okay. <laughs> oh, man. That's a lot of carving, but it's going faster than expected. The thing is when it's into the mass production step, it's way faster than the concept and tests phase. But it's a lot to do still. I decided to have um, the ornaments on the small towers, um, pyramids, basic. And the middle one gets a little bit fancy as it's the centerpiece and a little bit cooler. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go.
exhausting. It's really exhausting. Oh, my eyes are flickering now. It's the first time I'm crafting for one year now. And it's the first time I'm really exhausted. I think I overdid a little bit on this project. But I gotta work through it now. <laughs> At first sight, the whole table is trash to throw away. Because uh, look at this, it's just, if, if, if there was a cleaning lady for the first time here, I guess she would just get a real big bucket and throw everything away. Yeah. That's how it is. <laughs> and the thing is, why isn't this damn temple ready? I'm a little bit upset. I'm really upset with my art supply online shop. And then I ordered something. It said three to five days delivery time on the website. Okay, now it's two weeks. I need the colors for this damn temple and I want to finish the temple. I cannot throw this in a bucket. I will never find the pieces again. This is all planned out. So now I'm working around and everything else is a mess. It's always a mess, but it's, it's so much chaos that I'm getting confused and upset. It's too much chaos. And I want this damn color now. So now I'm trying to clean around the Aztec temple and sort everything out again. Now I know why I'm so mad. Because this uh, mail order thing is, is killing my vibe, it's killing my flow. And there's a lot of uh, details planned out, but I did not write them down. And I'm forgetting it. And that's why I'm so mad about myself, that uh, I'm forgetting my master plan. I'm a visual guy, so I make stacks. So now this is uh, rearranged and sorted out. So I hope those colors come soon, otherwise I go crazy. So finally, finally, finally this color came. So now batch bucket texture painting. Fast, Zeitraffer, uh, fast, uh, time lapse, time lapse. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
this is what happened today. The top temple thingies, which look like birds now. <laughs> Stunned birds. The stairs are all glued on. So here is lots of leftovers. And here it's getting uh, less. Just had a happy accident. So here are the big panels I want to put on top of the of those uh, bottom bases. So I have them here. And they drive pretty nice. But check this out. The back sides are even nicer. not much left <laughs> the first one especially the first one the small one uh, there I had to think a little bit and to test and uh, try out the second one was okay that's working and now the rest is just no-brainers because the planning was right I have enough tiles for everything did my <laughs> Did the right math and then it's just grinding <laughs> like leveling in a nasty computer game just grinding but it's definitely worth it I, I always get asked why do I prepaint every every stone has its unique pattern and you cannot paint it like this when it's glued on so I do this in the batch painting and after this assembly I could stop here, it's, it, it's okay, but I, I don't stop, I do some weathering and some flocking and stuff and maybe filling some more gaps with plaster or with small tiles, don't know yet, let's see, it's like building a kit then, only you made the kit yourself. subscribing and uh, hitting the like button and if you forgot about it please do now at once good morning from uh, the workshop let's go crafting <laughs> Markers on the top. I don't like them. The, the 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 thing is cool. The the carving, but I don't like how the painting turned out. And I'm going back and forth and back and forth with washes and highlights and washes and highlights. But it doesn't um, 
it looks like shit. Those are some Aztec alphabet symbols. It's not sparking joy yet. <laughs> I need to work a little bit more on those. Blend it together with the rest. We'll get there some day. Yeah, and as always, uh, here is uh, the begging announcement. Uh, go become a Patreon on Patreon. Check out my Amazon wish list in the description below, or buy me a coffee, baby. <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah